So here we go. The best against the best. It's what the International Champions Cup is all about. Ever since its inception, it has brought together the most famous club sides in world football and given us matches with edge and meaning aplenty. The clubs love what it does for them. The fans from North America to Southeast Asia just cannot get in asked to keep the tradition going in a new look back for Zhao Felix signed from Benfica for 126 million is required to take on the mantle of Antoine Griezmann and he also starts here but Marcos Llorente signed from Real Madrid for 40 million back home but this should not inconvenience these players superstars on both sides Mark with the shifted right to Diego Costa and Atletico have scored within 43 seconds here Talk about being caught cold in the heat. Real Madrid nowhere, and Atletico lead 1-0. Well, that's it. They lost a challenge on the halfway line now. It's another race for Ramos to get back on side. Such a poor touch. They were very, very slow to start against Arsenal. Now, look at this. Saul has got it. And it's two. And João Felix weighs in with a goal for his new club. A fabulous start to his Atletico Madrid career. Again, finding João Felix. João Felix again! Courtois, in goal, throws his arms wide and says, I need a bit of help here, guys. They couldn't so easily be three down. Four against... Two. ...player in the great tradition, Lamar. Deflection. Big club now. But what about the understanding oh. between these two boys down the left? This is a, a very promising development. Even this early for Atletico with side. It's nicely done by Coque. Brilliantly done. Oh, and it's three. Oh, it's fantastic. They can't stop themselves from scoring. Correa's in this time. Oh, what a goal. Coque so very in place as a kind of a system for this season honestly don't know I'm, I'm, but I looked at the team and I saw five midfield players and one striker up front and uh, I thought how is he going to play how is he going to make this team work from because he's got Vinicius Junior didn't wait for Rosriasola this time and Oblak took one then he got a, a strong hand on the ball well, it's Jovic I think trying to get on the end of it which he's entitled to it was a great ball in and it's a 50-50. The goalkeeper, All Black, is very, very brave. All right. The defence. What about, you know, Nacho? What about Sergio Ramos and Marcelo? And they're, they're not playing well at all. That was quite agricultural from Ramos, wasn't it? Yeah. I think that's his way of sort of saying... Him up. Look at that pass, it's awful. Saul won it back, and here we go again, and it's four. And this is actually becoming embarrassing for Real Madrid. Well, it's easy for Saul because if you anticipate and you want to get to the ball before the opposition and they're in second gear, only he knows how badly injured he was. You know, I mean, if there's certain players don't have a high pain threshold. Yeah. Well, it was his left knee, as I made the point, and they haven't had a good time with left knees, as I said, Marcus said you. Hopefully it's nothing serious. And there's a yellow card, and that's the edge we were talking about. Something was amiss, and everybody... It was nearly five, thanks to Ramos there. Everybody at the time said, oh, no, it's only the warm-up games. It's by him. It's a good one. Sharp oh. stop from Courtois, completely unchallenged. Was it Savage who went for it? Yeah, and this is awful. He has nobody picking him up, marking him. It's a free header. Have a look at this. Where's his marker going? It looks like it's Tony Cruz. One game before tonight, and here's Kieran Trippier arriving in the box. It's a great ball by Trippier, wow. and it should again be five. Oh, fabulous ball, Kieran Trippier. I tell you, that was different class. Lamar would be disappointed he hasn't put that one away. Super ball. I think Carvajal's going to end up getting in instead of... Oh, oh, oh! That's a bit more like it, and Oblak gets a lucky bounce back off the post. Vinicius Junior hit the post, but he couldn't squeeze it into the net, which is what Real Madrid really need right now. Yeah, that's the best moment of the first half for Real Madrid. Atletico's goalkeeper. This is not a misprint, incidentally, if you've been out on Friday night coming back. Maybe you had... ...to João Felix, who's shaping up so, so very well. João Felix! A new name to so many over here. Not for so many over here. Not for much longer. 
Diego Costa went over. It might be a penalty. It is, it is a penalty. Costa down the middle, beats Courtois, and Real Madrid would rather be anywhere else right now. It's Real Madrid nil, Atletico Madrid five, and honestly, hardly... 33 times La Liga champions, peerless, the 13-time European champions, and in this International Champions Cup meeting here in New York, Real Madrid have looked a pale imitation of their club's great history. It has been from Carvajal player flattened in the uh, line of sight of the referee that time well it was Lucas Vasquez a couple of late challenges come in there referee not happy Lamar well he's caught late it's Lodi actually just beyond Benzema Luka Modric from Luka Modric, but he did throw himself a bit theatrically for my liking. 68 and oh. likely to go six behind in this game. They are six behind. He just cannot stop scoring tonight. Diego Costa has done it again. Oh, four goals. He has found his form. He is on cloud nine. Honestly, every time he gets the ball... He Madrid supporters will be watching through the... Found Marcelo, Marcelo goes for the spectacular. Well, it has to be spectacular because he's surrounded by red and white striped shirts and it's first touch, he flicks it off. Still alive here, mm. briefly. Sergio Ramos going for the spectacular overhead kick. It looks as though he's run it back. Benzema goes for it. Well, he got up, but he couldn't hit the target with it. Does he give a corner kick? Does, does it come off someone else? I thought... Edin Hazard. That's a bit more like it from Hazard, and they get one back Real Madrid. The last touch might have been by Nacho. I don't think he knew too much about it. It hit him rather than him putting the ball in the net. And it was good play from Edin Hazard. That's a really positive attack and roll he's shown there. On the left. Not giving up on it, and credit to him for that. We were told all through today will definitely not be. Oh, 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 oh. Bound to get feisty. Challenge. It always does here, and people need to put their arms down. Diego Costa's in the middle of it, and he's lost the plot as he tends to do all too often. Carvajal actually took the first hit, and he didn't like it much. Well, that's what I was talking about, and it's Lucas. I think. And Lucas is not happy. Just gives you everything every week. This is a fabulous run forward, and it's an even better finish to make it 7-1 wow. for Atletico Madrid. There's no end to this. Navas got nowhere near it. Another special goal tonight from Atletico Madrid. It's still alive. Vitolo onto the bits and pieces, and it's around the post and out where it can do no harm, but wow. the harm has been done already again. Vasquez. Rodrigo's cross wasn't a bad one, and Gareth Bale was in there. It's over, but there's more punishment to come. Unbelievable. <laughs> gets away with one. He, kn he knew nothing about it. It should have been it. It really should have been it. I don't know whether this is actually becoming more embarrassing now than the first half, because Atletico Madrid... They've been shown up so badly here oh my goodness everything went right Paul honestly it should have been another goal this could be another big moment in the season ahead if they're going to get it's Simeone and Atletico Madrid's hearts that have been broken more than any other club by Real Madrid in the Champions League of course yep but raising yourself for one or two games a season is not the same as plus for them here's a good run is there to be a swan song for Gareth Bale he'd like it that's class. He has that acceleration. Looks like he hardly broke sweat as he. Penalty for Real Madrid. 
and a fig leaf to cover some of their wounded pride, perhaps. Nacho won it, he was a bit too clever. <laughs> concede again. He does concede again. Well, this game's finishing 2-2, the second half. They lost the first half 5-0, but he'll say we, we drew. Quick one by the young Uruguayan Sanabria. Sanabria actually born in the United States. Guess. Deflection on the cross. All along the goal line and turned in. It's another one for Real Madrid. Wow, that's fantastic stuff. I have to say, the shot from uh, Kubo from the edge of the box was... To a degree, masks what has happened here this evening to Real Madrid. And right on 90 minutes, the referee calls it off. Nobody's going to be fooled by what we saw in the last 10 minutes here when Real Madrid did get the ball in the net on a couple of occasions. For the preceding 85 minutes or more, they have been given a lesson, a very...